For this craft, you'll need a paper cup, a balloon, some tape, a pencil, and pom-poms. But you might also want a piece of paper, some yarn, and some scissors. The first step is to blow up your balloon and then let all the air out. Then you'll want to cut off the top of your balloon. You don't have to cut very much off. Then tie off the end of your balloon. Now you'll need to remove the bottom of your cup. To do this, take your sharp pencil or pen and start poking holes all the way around the outside edge of the bottom of your cup. Then you can easily push the bottom out. Then you're going to stretch your balloon over the open bottom of your cup. Try to get the knot end of your balloon into the middle if you can. This will make shooting your pom-poms easier. Use some tape to secure your balloon to your cup. Now you have a pom popper. Load your pom pom, pull the tail end of the balloon, and pop! If your balloon keeps getting stuck inside of itself, you can tie a string to the end to pull it out easier. Now let's see what kind of games we can play with our pom poppers. One way to play would be to tie a string to a pom pom and then tape the other end of the string into the bottom of your cup. This way, when you pop it out, you can try to catch it. If you want an extra challenge, try to catch your pom-poms without the string attached. They'll fly a lot farther and you'll have to move around more to catch them. You can also set up cups or vases to try to shoot your pom-poms into. It takes a lot of practice. Another way to play is to make a target out of paper that you have to shoot your pom through. Woo! And finally, if you have more than one person, you can take turns trying to catch pom-poms. Woo! We did it! Thanks for watching!